and not many Nigerians born after the 80s can lay claim to the fond memories of the then popular TV series, The Village Headmaster. Good news is some of the actors have brought it back on stage 50 years after the masterpiece was created. Ola Wako was a witness to his return. <coughs> Headmaster, everything is not money. A typical scene from the series that held television audiences spellbound in the 60s, 70s and 80s on Nigerian television authority, NTA. They have put before me conditionalities that will strangulate me to quench. It didn't return alone. The village headmaster brought with it a huge wave of nostalgia that swept its audience. The surviving cast and crew of the nation's longest running television drama series have rekindled the fond memories by celebrating its golden years. Post Nigerian TV drama and possibly African TV drama, and of course, also written, created by first African television producer. Now, because we were going to do this, it's not possible for us to have it back. As you are aware, almost 80% of the main character are late. They are dead, you know, so we have to do with what we have. And the only thing we could do is just to bring a bubu job of some of the characters, some of the situation people already know in the program. We are seeing a reawakening of, uh, of drama that has a purpose that goes beyond mere entertainment. Um, we did not get too many messages today because it was supposed to be something that was um, highly entertaining, and it was, but we got some. And um, I, I think we've, we've just probably touched the tip of the iceberg. The masterfully crafted comic created by the late Ambassador Lucia Gmolushola got its actors to bond again. One major thematic preoccupation of the series was to celebrate cultural values, integrity and uprightness in the society by promoting national unity. And at that time there was no um, examination malpractices and teachers were teachers and it, that's what village headmaster is, is out to really uh, campaign for and keep those values of those days that we call uh, what do you call it now old school the new school has come without anything no values nothing and that's bad really bad for our kids the village headmaster family are happy to relieve the nostalgic feeling on stage again and for them, TV content creators should do more to produce films that will teach morals for sociocultural development. Ola Awakon, TVC News, Lagos.